Hi. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will show you tutorial how to create augmented reality showing a web page using ARJS, a JavaScript library. Let's get started. This is example of augmented reality application using ARJS library. For detailed video, you can watch my previous video about augmented reality OE monitoring system. This is augmented reality application that shows a Grafana dashboard for OE monitoring system. When detect a marker, it will show a Grafana dashboard over the marker. The shown web page will be refreshed every 30 seconds. This is the steps how to create augmented reality using ARJS library that shows web page. First, install web server for put the HTML code, so it can be accessed from the internet browser. In this tutorial, I use XAMPP as web server. And, also don't forget activate the SSL connection, so we can access the HTML page using HTTPS. You can find more information about activation SSL in Google. In this tutorial, we will create an augmented reality marker based, so we need a marker as a trigger to show the object. Next step, download our marker image, and marker pattern in our JS GitHub page. In this tutorial, I use Hero Marker. From this page, download two files of Hero Marker. First, image file with PNG format file, and the second one is pattern file with pat format file. Next step. Create a simple augmented reality using ARJS, we will use the downloaded marker. First, in XAMPP control panel, start the Apache service. In web server folder, there are three files, hero marker with image format, and hero marker pattern, and HTML file. Open the HTML file using notepad. This is simple code of augmented reality using ARJS, in header, put required ARJS JavaScript library. In marker element, set the marker as hero marker, set the URL of hero pattern file. And for the object, I use plane geometry, when access this HTML page, it will show a plane geometry as object over the marker. For testing, open AR HTML page in internet browser, and enable the camera. Don't forget to print the hero image marker. Aim the camera towards the marker, so that when the camera is aimed at the marker, plane geometry will appear over the marker, and follow the marker position. Next step, add captured image in plane geometry of augmented reality. In web server folder, add an image file. It is web page captured image. As example, this is captured or screenshot image of my Grafana dashboard. Edit test to HTML file, and add URL of image file in plane geometry element as image source. So when marker detected, ARJS will show the image over the marker. From this tutorial, we have learned how to display a screenshot of a web page in augmented reality. However, we want this screenshot image to be dynamic, 
and change according to the current state of the web page. For example, if we want to display a dashboard, the content shown in augmented reality must also be updated accordingly. To obtain web page screenshots periodically, we need to install Puppeteer in Node-RED. The function of this Puppeteer library is to capture web page screenshots at regular intervals, allowing the web page images to be updated according to the current conditions. For detailed Puppeteer installation, please watch my previous video about headless Chrome using Puppeteer. After Puppeteer installation, next step, create Node-RED flow to capture web page periodically and save the screenshot image into capture file in web server folder. This is the node red flow structure, in inject node, set interval 30 seconds, and go to launch node, then go to URL node, set the URL of web page target. Then, go to screenshot, and, close browser, then save the screenshot image into target file in web server. To ensure that all Chromium instances used by Puppeteer are closed properly, I've scheduled a Chromium end task using the exec node every one minute. This is important as having numerous unclosed Chromium tasks can consume the RAM memory. Next step, edit new HTML code to get refresh captured image periodically. In this HTML code, I add script to refresh the capture image every 5 seconds, and then I added the animation when marker detected. You can get the required file in this tutorial, I place the download link in the video description. From this tutorial, we have learned how to display a web page in augmented reality over a marker using ARJS. This augmented reality can be accessed using an internet browser, eliminating the need for app installation. Additionally, the displayed web page will be refreshed according to the specified interval. These are some conclusion from this tutorial. First, ARJS library is user-friendly tool for creating augmented reality experience, easy to create and access. However, it's important to note that currently, ARJS does not have capability to display web page as real-time in augmented reality. As an alternative to display web page in augmented reality, we can use a screenshot image of web page and show it on a plane geometry. To capture a screenshot of web page, we can use Puppeteer in Node-RED. To ensure proper closure of each executed Chromium instances, use exec node in Node-RED to terminate the Chromium processes. Because, leaving unclosed Chromium instances can lead to RAM memory overload. And, don't forget to enable SSL on web server, so the HTML augmented reality page can be accessed from other devices using HTTPS. Thank you for watching this video. I hope this tutorial video is helpful and inspiring for you. Don't forget to like, and subscribe. See you in the next video.